Hello there everyone, it's uh, Wheelchair Bandit here, got some wisdoms for you, um, and I've got a very special guest today, it's a good friend of mine, you want to introduce yourself? Wisdoms! <laughs> See the thing is, right, about chickens and how they roll, chickens don't roll, but their eggs do, so what they do is when they have the egg, they compete against it to see if it will be an inferior chicken or not, so um, th my name's Chris, basically. Is the answer to that question. <laughs> so that was a very elaborate intro from my friend Chris there. Yes, yeah, so that's m my life is elaborate. It's like, quite an elaborate guy. Yeah, it's like I'm like a, bit, a strange spaghetti that never ends. <laughs> like you just eat it, and you know, even it's not even in the plate anymore. You just go, and you follow it through life, and it ends up in Beijing. <laughs> so question one then. <laughs> Right. Um, there was a bunch of questions from a friend of mine, uh, Liam Doss, King or Doss. King Dawson, as he said he wants to be called. Can we, can we call him Doss? We can call him King Doss. King Doss, yeah. King Doss. Oh my God, Metal Gear, that kind of thing, you know? Like, <laughs> Doss, man. No? Okay, right. Um, okay, he asked a bunch of questions. The first one was, um, what's your alcoholic beverage of choice? I know yours. What, what's mine? Do you know mine? Beer, I would, it was beer. Some, form, some form of beer. I drink beer because it's best buy for money. But if True. if I had if I had if I had I just drink straight vermouth. Straight what? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> no, I I think I think if if money wasn't involved, I'd probably just drink a lot of Russian standard vodka, which is, is probably my favourite. Or straight if, or, or not, not 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 straight. I'd probably I'd probably throw in a cheeky a cheeky. A cheeky mixer in there, a maybe of the carbonated variety, mostly the brown carbonated variety, not like carbonated <laughs> shite water. You don't want that. I mean, I mean like Pepsi or or Coke. Or, um, yeah, but yours is like oh, you always drink Magners. Magners, uh, yeah, or or beer, just any like Mi Miller is my favorite beer, or Magners is probably what I choose in a pub. Maybe you should get some Bagners. So what's that? Ba it's beer and Magnus. <laughs> Bagners. Or some I mirror. Just, I've never had some beer, mirror. Beer some pear so mirror. Pear mirror. Pear mirror. That just that sounds a bit a bit erotic, really. You don't you don't want to go to spoons and order a, a pear mirror <laughs> because I think you'd just get out. Just get out of, get out of this <laughs> out of this place. Anyway, next question. Um food of choice. What's your what's your favourite edible delicacy? <laughs> edible del as opposed to those non edible delicacies. Mm, I like to rub my face with ducks. Um, <laughs> could you just imagine walking in like a mother walking in and just seeing <laughs> you're you sitting there with a duck on your face a duck on my face and it's going <laughs> like it's in pain but it's a bit emotional pain like it can't <laughs> it can't handle the situation no my my, my food is pro is mostly Italian based food I'll eat and I make mostly Italian based food or chilli or anything <laughs> but mostly chili and chili. It will say chili, right? You. Well, I'm I'm quite into chilies. I like spicy stuff. Lots of curries. Mm, yes. I went to a Nepalese place in Kirkcaldy. Is it good? Know, it's awesome. Is it like, the best curry I've ever had? Oh. It was it was really 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 good. Okay. So spice. I put jalapenos in pretty much everything. You you do that that food one. is food is awesome. I feel sorry for people who live in the same place as you. <laughs> Why? Smell wise. Smell wise. Smell -wise. I don't, Shite too much. <laughs> it's just, just I know I did a shite too much. Like anyway, next question. Who is your your biggest inspiration in life? Oh, well, we'll do yours first. We'll do mine first. Yeah. Um. Inspirations in life. Mm -hmm. I would have to say Gandhi. You notice that you said <laughs> that when somebody got their throat slit, yeah? Hey, <laughs> so Gandhi. I have to say Gandhi. Come but the hell, blood everywhere. <laughs> Uh, Gandhi, why Gandhi? I don't why know, because he's a good guy and he has he, good, good morals. And... Aye, so is the guy next door. Is that? No, actually, the guy next door, I think she used to be a prostitute. Oh, right. So, no. Well, that lamppost, he's a good guy. The lamppost, yeah. I would aspire to be everything that lamppost stands for. See, every, but he stands for a start. <laughs> What are you trying to say? <laughs> what are you trying to say? <laughs> no, I didn't mean it like that. I just meant, uh, you know, you say to stand. I didn't know. Oh, God, no. Oh. I do this a lot, right? And this is the thing. I do it in pubs as well and stuff like that. And everyone just looks at me and says, Chris, you're a fucking idiot. You really <laughs> I'm very sorry. No, uh, my my inspiration is uh, not music-based. I don't... I don't sit in, uh, like I, I do I do like what they've given the world. People like Mother Teresa and... Um, Colonel Gaddafi, um, 
I mean, they've contributed to the world in some way or other. But uh, my inspirations are more like musical and what I would prefer to be. So it's stuff like David Gilmore, Dallas Green, uh, not so much Jimi Hendrix. Uh, I find him quite boring, considering he's dead. Um, <laughs> yeah, they don't tend to be quite uh, exciting inspir- after, after they've lost their. Cause I'm a voodoo child, voodoo child. Yes, in the in in the in in the dirt. Stay there. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't really have much of inspirational people. It's just music inspires me. But anyway, we'll move on. Move on. Um, favorite movie ever would be. Oh, I hate these questions. I hate. <laughs> I hate how vague these questions are because I could ramble for an hour about food or movie. But my favorite movie is probably Goodwill Hunting. I've never seen that. I'm, I'm stupidly disappointed in you. Stupidly disappointed. I have in no you. idea how angry I am inside. <laughs> Just because I've never seen Goodwill Hunting. It's a film about the tragedy of being born in the shit and having amazing abilities and rising to the. I just watch it. It's it's very good film. But what's favorite film? Probably, um, my favorite film. Um, probably something like old school, like Never Ending Story. It's like, yeah, it's like, awesome. I like, have a question for you. Why is there a never ending story too? Because the story never ends. Yes. Yeah, so, <laughs> so why is there a, why is there a why does it have to be a two? Why can't it just be the never ending story and that's it? Yeah. What, don't, don't I don't know. The second one was miserable. It was horrible. Was it? Yeah. And I've heard there was a third one. I'm not even going to attempt to watch that. I, I think I think we should we should never discuss it. I think it would d- destroy our dreams and <laughs> you know, as children, you know. I'm trying to think what other films I'm really, I really love. I don't know. I'm sure there was one from a while ago. I was like, I don't watch films that often. I'm more of just video games and music, really. I'm I'm more like vid, like movies and and music because I I I am good at video games. I just kind of stop playing them so much. Yeah. But we'll move on. That, move on. That, Beetlejuice. There we go. There's one. Of Beetlejuice. Films. There you go. That, that's one. There we go, that one. <laughs> Um, and then number five of Doz's questions was um, your favourite retro or childhood video game you've explained this already though I've, yeah I explained it in a previous video mm-hmm. but it could be interesting to hear some of your uh, well my kind of favourite childhood games were Tomb Raider basically that was the first game I actually properly played and I would ex- explain my sexual repression <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, it was mostly t- it was mostly PC games like the people who had consoles and stuff. I never had that. I had a PC, so I played a lot of like uh, MDK, uh, a lot of like the very off the wall PC games and stuff like that. So I c- I could only really say basically Spider Man and Tomb Raider. I think I think that would probably be about it. Yeah. Really, I mean, how do you define retro? Really? Um, well, yeah, I don't. Eight eight bit? No, I mean. To me, to I me, I never experienced any eight bit. My first console was a PS One. No, I think uh, as eight bit as we got was our wanks when we were like twelve. <laughs> An eight bit wank. <laughs> An eight bit wank. <laughs> I just was your wank and just still eight bit music in the background. <laughs> it's a me, Mario. Um, no, I don't know where I was going with that. Anyway, uh, no, I think gaming gaming is something that I've been I've been doing solidly. I think when you when you were. The video is like nearly, nearly over. Oh, that's a bit shit. We can ramble on if you want. Uh, well, we'll do a wee bit. But basically, uh, like when you were a lot younger, you didn't play so much video games, did you? Not so much. I was out all the time. Yeah, well, it was quite the opposite because uh, I played a lot of the video games when I was a lot younger, uh, but I don't anymore. But that's basically it. Uh, you know, it's something that, all in all, right... <laughs> If I was to go back and play games and stuff like that, I, w- I would probably just... In fact, I do play Tomb Raider now more than anything. I just whap it back on, but uh, that's about I'll it. Whap it. Whap it on. <laughs> whap it out, you know? <laughs> well, no, don't do it like that. Don't Get your chibs out. No, get your... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So there's a new Lara Croft game coming out, right? The Guardian of Light? The, 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 no, that's been out no, a while. Been out. There, there is another one, I think, on the horizon, and to be honest, I, I think it's... I want her, I want her to die. Now. <laughs> I want her to just lay down and die. But that's we've got another question. We've got another question. Do we have yes. another question? Yes. I think see, wait, a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay. Read out to me. Um, what's the most important thing to remember when life gets you down? Oh, it's deep today, kiddies. <laughs>